A group of carolers in Kentucky thought that it would might it might be a good idea to do a fun prank where they approach unsuspecting individuals and start caroling to them. Although there's a race component to this. It's a group of black men that are purposely dressed uh, what's considered in an intimidating way. And the reactions from the people that they approach are interesting. So let's take a quick look at it. When strangers just strolled their way into the estates of Saratoga Woods, let's just say Neighborhood Watch took on a whole new meaning. Yet panic quickly turned to praise. The acapella group Lincoln Bridge pulled this gag all over Louisville and saw reactions much the same. This guy answers the door timid, then calls for his wife. In a parking garage, the lady stopped in their tracks, then stuttered in disbelief. The officer at a bank stands to attention the moment the guys enter, and by the end, sings right along. Pretty much the message is it doesn't matter if you're black or you're white or whatever color you are, you can't be judged by what you have on. So in the post game for the members, I want to discuss whether a cappella groups are acceptable. But that's a different conversation. Okay, TRTnetwork.com slash join yeah. to become a member. Okay, now, uh, I love this story for a number of different reasons because there's a lot of unexpected things. First of all, um, yeah, you can't judge a book by its cover. But if I'm in that parking lot and six dudes of any race are coming at me like that going, what's up, I'm going to back up. <laughs> okay, let's keep it real. So I'm going to keep it extra real. Okay? Extra real. Yeah, cover. I'm going to keep it extra real. Um, look, Part of growing as an individual and un is understanding your own biases, your your own faults, and how you've bought into stereotypes. I I'm going to be clear. If I was in a parking lot and I was approached by five guys that look like them, mm -hmm. I would be scared. If I was approached by five guys that look like they go to Harvard, I wouldn't be intimidated, right? So the way they look does matter, unfortunately, and that's my own bias. So now I'll add a, a wrinkle to that. It's very important. Is how you're dressed, right? Yes. So that's when you say it looked like that, right? So if it was an acapella group from Harvard and they had their sweater vests on, <laughs> and and they 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 could be just as black, <laughs> yeah, just as black. That sounds funny, okay? Uh, but they're there and they're like, mm, 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 right? Yeah, you'd be like, oh, then that happened. <laughs> right? You're not going to get intimidated, it, it, but yeah, they're wearing clothes and they got they spread out. All the context matters. So. If it's uh, six young black kids that show up at your door, well, you'd think honestly. I'll tell you my bias. I think they're going to sell candy. Yeah. Okay. I don't know. What, you know, six anybody showing up uh, at your door outside of Halloween, mm -hmm. and you think they're here to sell something. Yeah. <laughs> right. So um, and then so I don't mind the, the first person going, "Whoa, what's going on?" I actually think that this story eventually becomes great. Mm -hmm. Right. I. I'm heartened by the white reaction in the story. Yet because I mean they're like, "Oh, they didn't they're singing a cappella." Okay, then great. Then there's no problem. Yeah. See, if they were not true racist cuz racism has a great spectrum of degrees. Yes. The only racism isn't, "Okay, I hate black people. I will now punch them in the face," right? Uh and there's a lot of co like understated uh, undertones of racism that's very real and affects people and partly what they're trying to show here but to the credit of everybody at least in this video and it's a great video by WDRB a local station there they should mm -hmm. check out in its entirety uh, is that once they realize what's going on like the bank guard if six dudes lo uh, walk in with that kind of clothing again even if they're white they got hoods on or they yeah. got caps on and I'm a bank security guard I'm gonna stand up right yeah and but Despite the fact that they're black, and if they if the guy was an overt racist, he he wouldn't care that he, they're singing a cappella. He'd be like, "Hey, move along, guys, move along." Right? Yeah. He joins in. He hugs them at the end. Yeah. Look, I yes, that's all good. Um, maybe I'm being uh, like too grumpy about this story, but I mean, did they see cameras pointed in their direction? And if they did, maybe they're more likely to act differently. You see what I'm saying? Like, mm. I, I don't know. That could be a possibility. They could just be great people who get scared at first, and then they're like, oh, great, acapella music. 
personally, I don't like people singing to me, so I feel like um, I probably wouldn't open the door at all. I'd be like, please stop singing. This is making me uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> How uncomfortable is it when someone's singing to you? Admit it. Only the most uncomfortable thing <laughs> yes. in the world, but I. It's too rude not to open the door. Yes, okay. I still would not I, open the door. I'd open the door. I just don't want to deal. Grin and bear it. Like, uh, yeah. Well, uh, mm -hmm. <laughs>